What if everything we know is wrong? Welcome to our video exploration of But What If We Are Wrong. Join us as we dive into the depths of Klosterman's interdisciplinary insights, the impact of culture on our beliefs, and the art of prediction. But What If We Are Wrong is an enthralling and intellectually stimulating book penned by the renowned cultural critic, Chuck Klosterman. With his signature wit and thought-provoking insights, Klaus Dermann takes readers on a captivating journey that challenges conventional wisdom and delves into the fascinating notion of predicting the future. Through a tapestry of diverse subjects ranging from science and literature to sports and pop culture, Klaus Dermann crafts a compelling argument that encourages readers to question their assumptions about the present and ponder the likelihood of being wrong about what lies ahead. In this video, we will explore the key themes and strengths of this groundbreaking book. 1. Thought-provoking concepts. The book begins with an intriguing question. How does our understanding of the past shape our perception of the present and future? Klaus Dermann presents a wide array of mind-bending ideas that linger in the reader's mind long after the final page. One of the book's central themes revolves around the concept of time and how our understanding of the past shapes our perception of the present and future. He aptly draws parallels between historic mistakes and current popular opinions, suggesting that future generations may perceive our ideas as archaic and misguided. Klosterman forces readers to confront their biases, making them realize that their firmly held beliefs might be perceived as laughably wrong in the future. 2. Interdisciplinary Approach Klaus Dermann's brilliance lies in his ability to draw connections between disparate subjects, exploring their potential implications for the future. He artfully blends discussions on physics, literature, music, sports, and technology to construct an interdisciplinary narrative that seamlessly flows from one chapter to another. The diversity of topics keeps the reader engaged while effectively conveying the central message that everything we accept as true today could be subject to revision and reassessment in the future. 3. Cultural and Social Commentary Throughout the book, Klaus Dermann delves into various cultural artifacts and societal norms, dissecting their significance and questioning their long-term impact. He explores the impact of literature, art, and music on shaping the collective consciousness of society and considers how these contributions might be interpreted in the future. His insights into the significance of reality television, celebrity culture, and sports create an interesting discourse on the evolution of culture and how it might be perceived by future generations. Four. The Art of Prediction Klaus Dermann masterfully engages in a thought experiment about the nature of prediction and its limitations. Drawing on examples from history, science, and even sports, he contemplates the accuracy of our predictions about the future and how unpredictability often surprises us. By weaving through speculative scenarios, he highlights the fragility of our current knowledge and the hubris of believing we have it all figured out. This section alone is worth the price of the book, as it urges readers to develop a healthy sense of humility in the face of uncertainty. 5. Playful and Engaging Writing Style Chuck Klosterman's writing style is both accessible and reliable. He uses humor, anecdotes, and personal reflections to make complex ideas more palatable to readers from all walks of life. His conversational tone draws readers in, making them feel like participants in an engaging conversation rather than passive observers. This playful approach keeps readers eager to turn each page, even when the subject matter becomes more philosophically intricate. 
6. Tackling Ethical Dilemmas In a section that is sure to spark countless debates, Klaus Sturman navigates the moral dilemmas surrounding certain historical figures, cultural icons, and revered artworks. By contemplating the potential for these figures to be judged harshly by future generations, Klaus Sturman encourages readers to reconsider the ethics of idolizing and celebrating individuals with complicated histories. It's a thought-provoking exploration of how cultural values and norms evolve over time, leading us to question what we hold dear today. 7. A Call for Better Critical Thinking The book serves as a call to action for better critical thinking and a more open-minded approach to the world. Klaus Sturman challenges readers to question their assumptions, evaluate their beliefs, and be open to the possibility of being wrong. He advocates for intellectual curiosity and a willingness to entertain opposing viewpoints, as it is through such a mindset that we can better understand the world and its ever-changing nature. In conclusion, But What If We Are Wrong is a tawdy force that beckons readers to embark on an intellectual odyssey. Chuck Klasterman skillfully explores the boundaries of human knowledge, leaving no stone unturned in his pursuit of understanding the intricacies of our perception of reality and the future. With a captivating blend of humor, cultural commentary, and philosophical ponderings, Klaus Sturman challenges readers to break free from the confines of presentism and embrace the uncertain nature of the future. This book will resonate with readers of all interests and backgrounds, inspiring them to question their assumptions and engage in a deeper examination of the world around them. But What If We Are Wrong is an enduring work that leaves a lasting impact, solidifying Klaus Sturman's position as one of the most compelling cultural critics of our time. If you are a fan of mind-bending ideas, cultural commentary, and thought-provoking concepts, I highly recommend diving into But What If We Are Wrong by Chuck Klaus Sturman. Thank you for joining us today on this captivating journey of But What If We Are Wrong. Until next time, keep exploring the depths of your curiosity, because sometimes, it's through questioning our beliefs that we discover the most profound truths.